Hello everyone and welcome back to another Warcraft 3 gameplay cast by me. Yes, me. And if you can see that caster thinness guy in the bottom, that's also me. I'm popular. Alright, let me do my check here. After that Twitch change up, I had to of course get the new stream key and all that mumbo jumbo and I'm good. This game was taken from the Zodiac Cup. The cup that I also personally casted on my stream, but for those who were not able to see it, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for your loss. But why is the I don't hear like the clicking sound when I click on stuff. Is that a bug? Whoa. Uh, everything's everything's just off-putting right now but let's just get down to the game this is from the Zodiac Cup it is a best of three and this is game one of that best of three I am very short on time so I may not be able to put game two up right away but I'll try to do it as soon as I can all right let's get it to this spawning as our yellow night elf we have Hawk no wait Sonic Sonic Sonic, I'm so I always confuse him for some reason. And his opponent spawning as the red human, it is Hawk. Not Elf versus Human here on Echo Isles. And it looks like we're gonna have a whisk wisp going around, scat around, seeing what's what. Meanwhile, looks like our human player over here is gonna go for the standard Archmage Footman build. Meanwhile, for my night elf, we're gonna see a demon hunter first, not very surprised there, and an archer being trained up. So looks like he's gonna do the passive ancient of war creeping. There's two kinds of ancient of war creep that night elf can do on this map. They can go aggressive and do the mercenary camp with ancient of war, which tends to lead to a quick expansion. A or they can do uh, ancient of War creep here, which leaves the Ancient of War very close to the base to protect. Now against human, most night elves do the passive Ancient of War creeping, as tower rushes are quite a common sight on Echo Owls. I mean, the grand final for the w WCG games between Yumiko and Moon was a tower rush game on Echo Isles, so hopefully players have learned by then. Alright, meanwhile though, it looks like our human player is going to be militia creeping the mercenary camp. That I'm not very surprised of. And it looks like the demon hunter is going to come over here and try to harass this. Human player will get the item though, it is a boots of speed. Wisp does dispel, and the game is loud. I don't want to make it too quiet. And the Wisp does dispel, taking away that water elemental. Very nice work by Sonic. Alright, meanwhile though, our Nido player is coming in. It looks like he went for Immortalation first, and oh, that's going to wreck the Militia. Demon Hunter gets level 2. Meanwhile, is is getting harassed. Nice whiff save. Very nice whiff save. God, I hate pingers. Alright, will another peasant go down? It's not looking good. Alright, well, another peasant goes down, but the rest are safely behind. This human base is blocked off. That was very nice harassment by the Night Elf. Very well worth it. Human player gonna try for a creep. Will the Demon Hunter get the last hit? Does go mana burn, so we won't be seeing evasion this game. Which means the Demon Hunter will be using quite a bit of mana. The human player still has not teched up, though. And oh, ooh. Oh, I can't see if there's mercenaries, but they want the mercenary. Who's gonna get the mercenary? Uh, I'm gonna say the Night Elf. I'm gonna say the Night Elf's gonna get the Mercenary Camp. Is he gonna get the camp? Who gets the camp? Oh, and it is the Night Elf! Night Elf picks up a Troll Berserker. And it looks like he's gonna run himself away. Berserker is blocking the Demon Hunter a little bit. You do not want to see that. Dispel being used. I didn't see where, though. Meanwhile, it looks like our Night Elf will be going double Ancient of War in Hunter's Hall. So it looks like he will be focusing on Huntresses. Which means his tech to tier 2 will be delayed a little bit. Oh! Demon Hunter trying to tick off the creeps. I don't think it worked as well as he wanted it to. Not as well as he wanted it to. I'm sorry if I keep pausing it. I just can't tell if it's too loud or not. Alright! The human player's militia creep in this gold mine camp, and the Night Elf does see this, and Night Elf knows the human's trying for a quick expansion. 
And as I say every time, quick expansions mean delayed tech for the humans, so he's gonna have to rely on militia and footmen for a while here. Yeah, I really don't like pingers. Uh, and the thing about huntresses, when you're forced to go for footmen for a while, huntresses beat footmen. It is very well known that huntresses beat footmen. So, yeah. I <laughs> have to see about that now, won't we? Lumber mill going up so he can fortify his expansion with towers because it will be harassed a lot. It will be harassed indeed. Troll Berserker. Oh, Troll Shadow Priest. Where is he getting these mercs? I don't see a wisp around here. Maybe Huntress picked him up. A player's forces are under attack. Ooh, good wisp detonation. Another good wisp detonation hitting both these water elementals. And getting rid of that Archmage mana. Alright, Nidalf is going to go in here. Will he be able to get the towers cancelled in time? Oh, one tower does go up. Will the second one go up? The peasants are trying their best to repair. Troll Berserker did go down. It looks like one tower will go down. It wasn't cancelled either. One tower is going to help though as Huntresses do take extra damage from piercing. Ah, oh, that Immortalation is wrecking those peasants. Archer goes down. Footmen are trying their best, but they're not the greatest against Huntresses. God, I really hate pingers. Oh my god, oh god, that's surround. Oh god, oh, oh. Demon Hunter gets level 3. Oh, and he TPs away. Oh. This surround was sick. You do not surround an immortalated Demon Hunter. That just doesn't work. Night Elf still is on tier 1. He's not making any more units. I don't know. Probably because he's supply capped, I suppose. But you think he'd start the tech. I mean, if you see the human player getting an expansion, you're going to want the tech advantage. Otherwise, the human player is going to be able to keep up with you and be ahead on both sides. Here, let's watch this as Thendus because I'm cool. Yeah. What is happening? My War 3 Arena caster official name, yeah. Caster Death Thendus. Yeah, I know, it's official, I'm cool. <laughs> the silence before the storm. Looks like the Nidal's gonna move in here again. He's got plenty of detonated he's got plenty of detonations to his disposal, and I think he's gonna get one water elemental. Ooh, Rock Golem being picked up by the Night Elf using that imbalance slow in the Archmage. Looks like more militia is going to have to be called to help defend this. One tower is up. Second tower just now starting. It won't be up for a while. Oh, uh, Rock Mud Golem goes down. Another medicine goes down. Mana Bring going down the Archmage. And the Archmage is getting focused. We all know the Archmage isn't the tankiest of heroes. And all the human units are being pushed back by this ragtag group of Night Elves and Ogres. We got any trolls in the mix? We do. Oh, Trouble Circuit getting blocked up by the West. Still goes down, though. Archmage is going to heal up and get a Clarity Pot. And with his boots of speed, he is much faster than a Demon Hunter without the speed. Oh, oh, ooh. Yee. Huntress is going in. Second Tower is going to go up, and that's going to help him greatly. Ancient Protector being built here. Night Elf's probably wanting to commit to this a little. I think he should cancel that tower because it doesn't look like he's going very well. Two militia being called a lot. They're weak health though. I have to leave in like 10 minutes so I hope this game ends. Hope this... Alright, looks like the Nile's going to try to attack into the human base here. Human base doesn't have any towers yet, now being built. And we'll get mana burned on the Archmage. Uh, 
Man, I'm still at tier 1, and he's making glaive throws. Okay, so it's confirmed. He is committing to this. If this attack doesn't work, he'll have no comeback play. He will have no comeback play at all. Alright, scout towers are being built here, but they're not being upgraded. Human player has no wood. He's gonna have to defend with what he got. Night Elf, once those farms go down, the floodgates are open and it'll just rain Night Elf units. Demon Hunter getting caught in a bad spot. Does get slowed in Mortalation, but he is surrounded. This time he doesn't have a TP though. Oh, he's doing so much damage. Oh, two footmen go down. Demon Hunter goes down. Archmage gets level four. Ancient Protector is being built to deal with this. We got some towers being upgraded though. And without a demon hunter to support this army, this army's not as strong. Now don't get me wrong, Hawk has some good micro. And Sonic. Both of these players have good micro. I keep confusing him. Hawk is the human, yeah, I know this. Ogre Mauler goes down. Ancient Protector being focused, I don't think he'll be able to go up, it's gonna have to be cancelled here. Moshe being called just to seal the deal here. Demon Hunter gets level 4. Looks like he was resurrected at the Neutral Hero Tavern. Oh, nice Wisp save on the Ancient Protector. Wisp is going to keep building. He wants to get that tower down. With these Glaive Throwers doing very nice damage on the Footman. Human player is going to want to try to focus those down. Alright, and the Glaive Throwers is going to be used on the towers here. Matt of trying to pick up more. More slow going down. That Mug Golem's definitely gotten his worth. Will he stay alive? Oh. Mug Golem does stay alive. Glaive Thrower's slowly sieging away. These peasants trying effortlessly to keep that guard tower alive. Remember, folks, this is game one of a best of three, too. So this is even all of it. I just won't be able to cast it all. I'll try to get the other game in sometime tomorrow, I promise. Huntress goes down. Mana burn going down. The Archmage slow going down. Looks like the Nidal picked himself his own mud golem. Does the human still have his? Oh, we got slow galore and no sorceresses. I didn't even notice the human's halfway up to tier 2. And if he gets tier 2, that's going to be pretty good. Alright, one Ancient Protector has gotten up. If only they still did siege damage like back in Reign of Chaos. Ooh, nice engagement going on here. S more slow going down, doing a nice job. Will detonate and cancel that slow and the water elemental. Archmage gets level 5 off of that. Gets level 3 water elementals. You're going to need more wisps, buddy. Oh, and the demon hunter gets surrounded again. He will use Immortalation, will he be able to get out? He's slowed! He's slowed! Does he have a Troll Shadow Priest? Oh! Ah. Oh, and the Demon Hunter gets out, I don't know how he gets out, and Chi Chi's called! Oh, that game was intense, alright! Hawk cuts up 1-0 in this best of three. Sorry I won't be able to put game 2 up right away. I'm sorry, but I have real life things to do. If you like this game, subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you want to watch me play Warcraft 3 or cast tournaments live such as these, follow me at Twitch at Thendis32. And I will see you later.